So guys, I am back with another Power World video and the panel I'm about to showcase to you guys today is the most overpowered power I have seen working on any base in any game ever. This thing is unreal, you do not want to miss this. How's it going guys? My name is DPJ and before we go any further, I'm giving away a couple of copies of Power World. To be with a chance of winning one, simply drop a like on the video, leave a comment down below and make sure you are subbed with those notifications turned on. Good luck. Okay, so Anubis, as you well know, guys, is the only level 4 handiwork power in this game. But I've, guys, got a level 5. And it's my other Anubis. As you can see right there, he's a level 5 in that handiwork. I have leveled this one guy out to the max. He's also got the passive skills of a plus 50% work speed and a plus 10% work speed. I mean, these are the best. You could probably do better than this, even. You could probably do faster than this, even. But what you're about to witness is unbelievable. So I actually got this uh, through breeding. So I bred this uh, Anubis. And then I continued on breeding. And this was the best one I could get. But then I also leveled him up with this machine over here, which is the power condensation machine. This guys, you insert your pal, then you have to sacrifice 4, then 16, and then 32, then 64. A grand total of 116 pals was used to make this guy a 4 star rating, which you can see just under his name there on your right hand side, or just under his, uh, his little picture. 116 other Anubises had to breed and sacrifice for this guy. And then guys, I leveled him up with the uh, statue of power which is just over here and I I think it's 10 times you can level him up this is took it in well left it took a chunk out of my power source and all that but right here guys so for instance this guy here you simply just click on that and he enhance it 10 times but as you go up you go up the individual and different variety of the power source which you probably already know but when it comes to crafting I don't think you are ready this guy is unbelievable so this one here I'm gonna compare it and show you to another, power, uh, another Anubis. This guy here has got a standard 70 work speed and that handiwork a level 4. No passive skills that help. I'm just going to showcase you guys this guy crafting one uh, legendary sphere. I mean that's pretty slow. Well it's actually quite quick considering the other powers in the game. That's pretty quick. Now, check out this guy. I don't think you're ready for this. I really don't think you're ready for this. <laughs> Craft one. That is unbelievable, the difference. So let's say we're crafting. I don't know. Let's just go with 100. Let's go with 100. Yeah. Go on in, lad. <laughs> what the? Did you guys just see that? How many? That was seconds? A hundred? It's unbelievable. And in regards to crafting other things too, like kitchens, lockers. So if I was to create a locker here, I say locker, I mean a storage container. Let me just build that there. Chuck yeah. you out. <laughs> that is unbelievable so why i actually did this for anubis was i bred it is a celery wait this is how i actually started the initial phase and you can do this from guys as soon as you get to a level 19 20 you can do this you can actually do this so a celery go out these are actually all over the place it's probably better to go to my power deck um let's go down here and we'll see so a celery you can see no it's not a celery that is a uh, habitat, they're all over the map, really, uh, located by bodies of water. But that's always to get go out and tame a male and female, simple as that. But then, guys, all you need to do is get this other pal, which is called uh, I can't remember his name now, <laughs> but it's somewhere down here. And it's actually at like a level 19 20, you'll find them on the map. Uh, oh, this guy right here, Relaxorus. This guy right here, guys, you can see him right there near the start. Right there, literally around level 19, 20, which is fair enough because that's a level you unlock the brooding pen, which is level 19. So by the time you get the, uh, the brooding pen, you can breed these guys 
over and over. So I'll get two Lexoses, two Celeres. Uh, so I obviously get male and female of each and breed them over and over. That's what I did until I had mating pairs of Anubises. And then I did exactly the same thing. And I end up, when you're seeing on the screen now, with eggs coming out my ass. I initially thought it was 64 in total. I was wrong. It's 112. It's 112 in total. And you have to condense them all into the same individual Anubis. And you end up with this guy right here. The absolute work monster. It's also now a level 4 in that mining. Did I forget to mention that? I think I did. But it's also a level 4 in that mining and a level 3 in transporting. Unreal. A work speed of 145. He is by far the most OP dude in regards to working on your base crafting. It's not a problem normal. It's literally not a problem anymore. And guys, just want to make a short but sweet video on the most OP <laughs> base power in this game guys if you enjoyed the video leaving a like really helps out if you like what you see and want to see more be sure to subscribe and hopefully guys i will see you on that next one